Hey guys, back again with yet another uh, quick update video on the Honda 125M. I figured since in the last video we got it to uh, start and run, albeit not as good as it should be, but regardless it's running after 26 years. I figured today maybe we'll, uh, we'll see if it will move under its own power for the first time in 26 years. So I guess I'm going to... Uh, I'm going to put some air in the tires and uh, check the oil in it again and we'll fire it up and see if we can't at least make it to the end of the driveway and back without the uh, chain wrapping up inside itself and busting a bunch of shit or the uh, tires going flat before I can make it back up here to the garage. So I think it's got a lot on its plate but uh, we'll, uh, we'll give it a shot and see what it does. It uh, it actually does drive. 
I was a little bit doubtful that it was going to because the uh, the person who uh, put this bike in that shed 26 years ago when I was talking to him he said uh, he said that he thought maybe it may have had clutch or transmission issues I did seem to notice when I had it on the grass in my backyard there a couple times when I shifted it slipped a little bit I couldn't get any any further than third gear um, as you seen when I came up, turned around and came up back by the car, by the time I shifted from first to second, I had already forgotten that this thing's a reverse shift pattern and I shifted the wrong direction. Um, so that wasn't any fault of the bike right there. Um, but, so yeah, it, uh, it does seem to move anyway. It may not actually smoothly ride through all the gears down the trail without any issues. I don't know. I can't keep air in the front tire long enough to be able to take it any further than the end of the driveway and back up so I'm not too sure I'm gonna try to maybe get the, the tube patched up in the front tire and then if I can do that I'll uh, maybe take it out to the uh, the riding park where I've done a few of my other videos we might actually try to take it for like a actual little ride around and see if it'll go through all the gears and everything like that so anyway hope you like the video guys if you did uh, click the thumbs up um, if you didn't, uh, click the thumbs down, and if you want to watch a couple more of my videos, there'll be uh, a couple at the bottom of the screen, and then a, uh, a subscribe link there right in the middle. So uh, it'd be great if you subscribe and leave a comment and a suggestion what you'd like to see done with the bike and all that stuff. Okay, thanks guys.